Hello, my name is Rachel Sermani and this song is called Two Birds and it's for Here, Here and Here. This is the last time I get to call Um, hello, my name is Rachel Sermani with Here, Here and Here. Um, difficult question, but in some respect, but I guess the easy answer is I started learning the guitar. I learned Stairway to Heaven of my dad's friend uh, when I was about 14. And from learning chords and things like that on the guitar, I, it was a natural progression to start putting words to it. I always liked poetry and things, so it's... When I was younger, when I was beginning, um, at that time when everything was coming together, um, there weren't too many influences. I was trying to keep up with what, whatever was cool in school. Um, but then actually, on an external level, we had lots of classics being played at home. Um, holidays were filled with um, 
uh, the, the car, the CDs in the car would be people like uh, Simon and Garfunkel and a Fairport Convention and a lovely lady from Yorkshire called Kate Rusby, a woman from Scotland called Corrine Polwart, lots of singer-songwriters and um, Eva Cassidy was a big one and I remember like listening, discovering people like Regina Spector and then I went to Glasgow and um, and slowly the spectrum just gets faster and faster. I was in, I remember being profoundly excited when I was introduced to people like uh, Tom Waits and Bjork and they allowed allowed me to stretch my mind a little bit and um, dirty projectors and people like them um, and I was introduced to lots of jazz when I was in Glasgow and yeah so it's it, now I, I, I think it's hard to pinpoint lots lots well I can't take credit for a marshmallow unicorn it was actually an Irishman who came up with that. I was playing um, a host of open mic nights about four years ago. I went to Dublin in order to just get heard, to be heard and um, to play a couple of gigs and try and make as much of an opportunity as I could in one week. And uh, I, that was a new song and, uh, and I said it, ha it was yet unnamed and uh, a guy came up and named it for me. tour has been a, loads of fun despite it being quite short and sweet. Um, I went to the Yukon again and um, that was really amazing because I was there for Dawson City Music Festival last year and I was very much affected by uh, the people and the surroundings and knew I wanted to get back so I didn't quite get back to Dawson but I got to Whitehorse which was a lovely place to experience and I got to see the Klondike again. and. Um, and breathe the high, fresh air. And uh, I had an amazing time um, playing alongside a bunch of poets from Vancouver, a girl called Hannah Johnson, um, a, a rapper called Big Nige, and a girl who wrote like erotica stories. And we had like a, um, um, we had an amazing night. Her name was Sandra O'Connell or O'Donnell. And um, it was just a house concert. It was very intense and very exciting. Uh, so yeah, uh, um, there's been lots of, I've, yeah, I've discovered a lot of poetry on this, on this tour, um, and that's been really a nice new thing. Hmm, nice windows, good light. Summer. Rivers. Glass. Churches. Instrument. Violin. Laughter. Happy! Extraordinary. <laughs> um, extraordinary. Um, wizards. <laughs> Good one. I like that one. Thank you so much. <laughs>